Hi, this is Andrey Maximov, the CEO of Precious Payload. Precious Payload is a software that provides faster access to information to support decision-making in space projects. We help space entrepreneurs test business and technology hypotheses with their payloads 10x faster and 5x cheaper. And today I'm giving away more than 60 payload ideas for your first satellite project. I'm going to talk about my favorite ones here in the video, but in the description of this video, we're going to have a link to the sort of database of all the uh, payload ideas across 10 different categories. And that would allow you to choose your favorite ones. And if there's a lot of interest in this video, I can record a further subsequent videos going into more details and examples of the missions that could be done with a particular technology. And also I wanted to give credit to Dr. Prashanth Marpu for providing us the initial information. He's our advisor to basically come up with this list. I'll start with the most popular ones. We're talking here about the um, observation missions. Observation is, you know, where the companies like Planet and Spire and the others started their journeys. And here we're talking about mainly RGB cameras, the or multi-spectral cameras that also have the infrared sensors on board. Then the further into the different bands we go, we can go into hyperspectral cameras. And then of course the these SAR, the Synthetic Aperture Radar Missions. So those would be the most popular category out there. Then there's of course the communication and communication is really the most, like the hottest topic there is the IoT, Internet of Things. So those would be the antennas that would relay the low power signals from the sensors on the ground. Those could be attached to containers, cars, trucks, trees, cows, and what's not. One of the largest section is the technology demonstration missions because those would be all your new antenna designs, battery technologies, of course, the thrusters, solar cells, etc. etc. So essentially when you want to validate your new technology, your new hardware in space, and then you know provide some heritage to your clients all those missions would fall into the category of the technology demonstration and then uh, a few of my favorite ones quite a hot topic now it's called in space manufacturing largely because those applications could be enabled by launch vehicles such as new glenn and starship which are coming online in the next couple of years because in space manufacturing is something that really is heavy reliance on the large volume of mass that you could lift to the lower Earth orbit, because not only you need to lift the internal protection equipment, but we're also talking about the raw materials and also perhaps the capsules that would deliver the manufactured goods back to Earth. So that all requires a lot of heavy lift capacity here. Thanks for watching, subscribe to our channel, and I hope I will be able to post a weekly update uh, with some useful materials on how to start a space company this year. Thank you so much.